Hello, and welcome to the Daily Almanac for February 4th. So, let's get started. First day in history! <laughs> On this day in history, February 4th, 1861, the first six southern states that has seceded from the Union organized a separate and independent government called the Confederate States of America. The states that set up this government were South Carolina, Mississippi, Florida, Alabama, Georgia, and Louisiana. 52 years later, on this day in 1913, a courageous American was born. Her name was Rosa Parks. She was a black woman living in Alabama at a time when blacks were not treated the same as white people. They couldn't eat in the same restaurants, or drink out of the same drinking fountains, or use the same restrooms, and when they rode on a public bus, black people had to sit in the back and leave the front seats for the whites. This practice of separating blacks and whites was called segregation. Many people knew segregation was wrong, but few people were willing to take a stand against it. That is, until Rosa Parks. One day, she was sitting on a bus after a hard day at work. It was December 1st, 1955. She was sitting towards the back at the beginning of the black section. The bus got more and more crowded until all the seats in the white section were taken. So the bus driver turned around and told Rosa to stand up so a white man could sit down in her seat. She said, no. The bus driver left the bus and came back with two policemen. They arrested her and put her in jail. The news of this arrest spread quickly and soon American citizens everywhere began speaking out. This event sparked the modern civil rights movement. People demanded change, and in November of 1956, the Supreme Court of the United States said the bus law which got Rosa arrested was illegal. This was a major blow against segregation. Before she died in 2005, Rosa Parks was presented the Congressional Medal of Honor, our nation's highest award for her courage. Today on Word Power, we're going to talk about the prefix try. Try is the Greek word for three. How many words can you think of that start with the prefix try? A triangle is a shape with three angles. A tricycle is a bike with three wheels. A triathlon is a race with three different sports. And a triceratops is a dinosaur with three horns on its head. <laughs> Today on Extremes, we ask, what people eat the most bread each year? The answer is the Turkish people. On average, each person in Turkey eats about 440 pounds or 200 kilograms of bread every year. That means that they eat more than a loaf of bread a day. Wow, I like bread, but that's incredible. I mean, how many sandwiches do you think you can make out of that? Health tips. <laughs> your nervous system is made up of your brain and the billions of nerves that flash messages through your body every moment of the day and night. Your nervous system is your body's system of communication. It's important to give your nervous system a little rest during the day. You can do this by sitting quietly, taking some deep breaths, and closing your eyes. I dive we all know that it's important to recycle, right? But did you know it's just as important to buy things that are made of recycled products? Ask your teacher if your school uses recycled paper. If it doesn't, you and your class could do a presentation to the principal about the benefits of recycled paper. Let the principal know that using recycled paper saves trees, energy, and water. 
Imagine how much healthier our planet would be if every school in the United States used recycled paper. Well, that's all the time we have left today for Daily Almanac. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you tomorrow.